we continue testing the new rules in the endpoint content extension or endpoint app in lieu of uh, ransomware type of attacks. So one of the things that you should do in your curator system is there are some reference sets, as we are seeing in here, that one in particular that we are testing in here is called malware URLs, who should be populated, which should be populated with uh, the URLs, the places that y you don't want people to go, right? And for that you can use the, uh, the Threat Intelligence app, I have done videos on that uh, before. Uh, Whatever is your source, or stick and taxi feed, whatever is your source, but your reference set should be loaded to which sites people should not be going. So, here in the curator, we clear all the offenses. Let's actually go into this Windows machine. And, and oh, by the way, as I have shown in all the videos, these Windows machines are fully patched. This is not exploitation of vulnerabilities. Uh, let's actually invoke a command that is going to contact that URL and curator should detect that and fire an offense. So in this command prompt we're going to execute this command that is going to be contacting that particular URL. Let's actually wait a little bit and go to curator offenses and refresh the screen and see if it detected this. And we have our offense that fire and one of the rules in that package is precisely that one. You don't need to understand the logic of it, you just uh, put it in your system, make sure your references are populated and it will detect this condition. I'm going to continue in this, I'm going to make short videos for every one of these uh, use cases so let's uh, stop here and continue with the next one.